Welcome back to the land of the robots. A robot utopia, if you will. Uh, this is a waypoint that we are checked into on our journey to explore what this island or I don't know what it is this island or these different areas might hold so oh well that's disturbing get up no we've got transcending to do that's problematic all right well that kind of sucks. Well, we can go down here to get some money. Uh, let's just see if there's anything sneaky that we can click on. I don't think so. Glorious commerce. Your robo bucks are accepted here. Ah, so... Oh, we can purchase... Wait, that's how much we have? Or that's what we can purchase? 26, 22, 10, and 8. I say that we save up for something good. Um, what am I doing here? Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to buy anything at the moment. I want to save up for something weird and exciting. Let's go this way. Let's go this way again. Eastern Botopia. Not much of value out this way. Oh. Well, but you've still got to explore here. Oh, whoops, I accidentally just clicked through that dialogue. Well, hope it wasn't important. Let's do it. All right, amoeba bot. Amoeba bot. Now, what do we have going on back here? Is that just, oh, this is just part of the scales. Got it. All right. And here's the hammer, so I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I can use the hammer to sacrifice um, a, uh, a card to turn it into, well, at least bones for for uh, the other type of decks. But this is replenishes energy back up to the current maximum. Oh, I see. So it's not just adding an extra um, level there. Okay. So we've got this alarm bot, which is annoying, but we'll just, that's, that's, I think it's a pretty good way to start. Yep, no problem. Okay. I say, what does this do again? Oh yeah, a copy is uh, created in your hand. That's perfect, actually. Good. Alright, get wrecked. Energy bot? No, I think we'll just delay over here. That's fine. Okay. We're up to four now. Uh, still nothing that I can really use. I guess I could put energy bot here, just to get me up to the maximum faster. But it almost seems like that's not super necessary at the moment. So that's actually just, just going to be able to kill him outright. I still don't understand why this was a card you would want in your own hand, but... I don't know. Let's grab one of these now. Sniper bot, yep. Throw them down. And, uh... Yep, that's good for me. That's fine. We're pretty much at the maximum energy now, right? So I may as well just grab this for the fun of it. Alright, let's make sure that we can get as much damage out there so that we can, uh... Get those sweet robo bucks. Uh, let's think about this. What can we do to maximize our our uh, damage? If we kill, use sniper bot to kill him, then we could open up this lane for somebody to attack the back row. But I don't think there's anybody. It doesn't really matter at this point. So. Um, 
Well, let me think. Right now we would be doing... Yeah, we need something there. Oh, we can't place anything there. Oh, that sucks. Okay. So we would be doing one, two, three, four, five, six damage, minus one. Doesn't matter either way. Uh, sure, we'll kill this guy. Alright, good job. Are you wondering about that star? Well, I wasn't, but now I am. You've been winning a lot. Now you've got a bounty on your head. It's sure to attract bounty hunters. It resets when you die, though. What does that mean? What what kind of bounty hunters can I expect? Just like tougher enemies type of thing? Um, a me bot is pretty good because it's so cheap. I think I'll take another one, one of those. Okay. I wish I could look at the map. Um, yeah, there's some flickering going on there, which makes me think that's where the bounty hunters are. Uh, let's go ahead and, and win our battle, and then we can retrace our steps and go from there. Alright, who do we have? Explode bot. Okay. We'll just delay, as is uh, our habit. Swap bot, huh? Let's delay here. Oh, hello. My name's Bolt Gearvik, and I'll be taking that scalp of yours. Nothing personal, kid. That's concerning. How much energy are we working with? There's no way... Oh, we're working with three, huh? So we're going to want to... Maybe wait for a automaton to come down to use the broken bot to uh, explode him. Leap bot is blocked. This guy is just super tanky. That's fine. The creature opposing it. Yeah, that would be good to take this bounty hunter out. Well, actually, you know what? Hmm. Ooh, interesting, interesting. So he's gonna do... They're gonna do one, two, three damage to me. I would love to be able to use... Uh, something to detonate the explode bot, which would kill the bounty hunter and the explosion, you know what I mean? I'm trying to think of the most efficient way to do it, because if I kill him this time then that's going to just remove the utility. So I think I'm going to have to, to tank one damage, or tank three damage, to set myself up for something good next time. I think. Unless I play shield bot now, right here, just to block him, my energy gets recharged. And then I... Oh, no, but a me bot is going to kill anything that's next to him, huh? Which is not super ideal. Yeah, I'm just going to... I'm just going to tank the energy, I think. So, let me draw from here. And... We'll let... We'll let them hit us. That's okay. Okay. Let's just take one of these to play it safe. So a me bot is going to go here. Going to kill them, which is going to kill these two guys. Which means we need to account for two more energy. We'll probably want to use our energy re replenishment thing here. 
So we'll put him there for sure. So those two guys are good to go. I could put energy bot over here and then re replenish it to maximum. That might be actually a decent uh, a decent plan. I think I want to do that, yeah. Okay. I could put the empty vessel down. Let's go ahead and... Uh, I don't want to put anything here because whatever is here is going to die. The swap bot... I could block. Actually, I think I'll have to block, right? Because I'm, I'm two hits away from death. So I'm going to have to put a... Uh, empty vessel down. Here. So if I do replenish it, then... If I put the shield bot... Here, that will kill him. Okay, that's actually... Good. That's fine. So I think that means no damage will be done to me in the back in my in my back row. Oh, why didn't why didn't that guy die? Hang on. Uh well that's problematic. I thought that I thought that he was supposed to die in the explosion. May, I must have misread it. That's concerning. Oh, that really sucks. Well. Let's see. The sniper bot. It's not going to be super effective. I think we have to go here, right? Kill two. He's going to kill him. Work on him. He'll hit one in the back row. That's all I can really do at the moment. Ooh, I'm in a tough spot. Alright, a bot is good. So let me just reread this. The creature opposing it... Uh, the creature opposing it, as well as adjacent friendly creatures, are dealt 10 damage. Which is fine. I don't mind losing the uh, energy bot. So if I use Sniper Bot, throw him here, shoot the Broken Bot, that's going to destroy Swap Bot. We've got another Swap Bot that we need to deal with, but we could do that with a Me Bot. Throw him here. That would kill him and do some work on him. I think that's the plan. Alright. A Me Bot going right there. And that's it. So I want to shoot the broken bot. Fine. Going to buy us some breathing room. The meat bot's going to go away. All right, swap bot. Actually... Oh, you can see, do you? No, no, no. We're going we're gonna to play this through. I want to I wanna take down this bounty hunter. Oh, I've got no more cards to draw, but... Yep. Because I want to get paid, you know what I mean? Shoot the back row, I think. Yep, that's going to switch it. And I'll do... Yes. I'll be taking that scalp another day. You ain't seen the last of old Bolt Gearvik. All right, and what that is going to do is give us a very nice five extra um, damage or five extra robot bucks. There we go. All right, nicely done. I really wish I could see the map. This is just my hand right now, right? 
No, I can't actually click on anything. Yeah. I'm locked in. Uh, I guess let's just keep moving. Oh, let's see. Why don't we go back this way and go up the, this to this middle area, maybe? All right. More money. Bust oh okay, a couple new ones. Busted 3D printer. <laughs> uh once a card bearing this sigil is struck, draw a card from your empty vessel pile. That's pretty good, actually. Yeah, that's pretty good. Gift bot, when a card bearing this sigil perishes, a random card is created in your hand. I wonder what that means. If it if it means like it's created in the sense that it's drawn randomly from the deck, or it could be anything. Hmm. And then Sniper Bot, we know. Oh, these are three very good options. Very, very good. Three D printer or Gift Bot? I'm I'm intrigued by the Gift Bot, and it's cheaper, so I'm gonna I'm gonna take that. All right, we've got another encounter coming in hot. Here we go. I wish I got some sort of incentive for for beating uh, beating the bounty hunter. I feel like I didn't really get rewarded other than just the uh, the extra money. Oh well. Anyway. Alrighty then. I'm gonna have to take Explode Bot out. But I won't be able to do it until next turn. So I just I just need an empty vessel to hold me over, really. I am gonna take one damage from Explode Bot, but it can't be helped. Oh! Right, I can kill. He he gives me uh the ability to kill. I totally blanked on that. Double gunner, we know about him. He's going to take out the empty vessel. So we just need something that can hit for one to take him out. Um, a me bot here reduces... Yeah, loses one power. We're going to have to sacrifice one of these guys, I think, for uh, against Explode Bot. Unfortunately. Let's just keep drawing from our main hand. Actually, let's put... Let's just do again once it's struck. Okay. I'm trying to think, who would I rather lose to Explode Bot? I think I would rather lose him. He's gonna do two against me. Oh, I should have I should have just let him hit me and then placed it over here. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh well. I still think we're gonna win. Oh, interesting. The rails are uh, getting knocked down, huh? Okay, um, let's do this just to give us more options. Ooh, gift box. Good. Alright, Amiibot here to reduce it by one. And gift box here, I guess, yeah? Alright, let's keep drawing from here. Ooh, sniper bot on the table could be extremely helpful. And we'll just save the rest. Uh, I can't hit this guy in the back, right? I'm, I'm always anxious to, but I don't think that's how it works. So he's got zero health, so how does that work? If, if I hit him for one, and then he switches... 
then does he automatically die? <laughs> I don't know. Did I already draw a card? I think I did. No, I'm just ready to concede my turn. Yeah, he just does... He, <laughs> he does just die. Confirmed. It's kind of strange. Alright, let's just get all of our cards. There we go. So why is he losing... Oh, he's... This is the perfect swap bot counter because he is losing one power from a me bot. Then switching it, his damage to... Uh, to his health and vice versa. And that's why he's automatically dying. That's actually kind of a cool interaction. Uh, that was totally... That was totally on purpose. I totally knew that would happen. I mean, I can't play anything else, so yeah. That's so funny. All right, didn't didn't get any extra money for that, unfortunately. All right, waypoint, good. Items 100% charged. Thank you so much. Bot spawners 100% offline. Lame. The power is dead on this old thing. I'll let you get up if you go get a new battery. Yeah, let's uh, explore, I guess. You're allowed in the inspection room only. Just get me the battery from the inspectometer and come back. Yes, I will totally just do that. All right, a brand new room to explore. This is exciting. Print progress. And that doesn't do anything. Well, that's cool. Is that a new a new card that I would be able to get um, from from like a 3D printing it somehow? Okay. Got his eye on me, doesn't he? All right, let's keep looking around. All right, we've got some puzzles uh, to knock out. All right, yep, yeah, that's just our uh, our little rules guide. Keep clicking around here. All right, why don't we why don't we knock out some puzzles? All right. I'm, I'm like 99% sure I understand what I'm supposed to do here now. As painful as it might be to watch me <laughs> do that. Uh, okay. So I definitely want this guy to explode in order to kill this for me to do four damage on the opposite side. So let's see here. Uh, no, I want to do that. So these guys, I will attack first. He will detonate to kill him. He will get killed as well. Or maybe he'll shrug it off because of this first damage. I'll attack him. Yeah, there we go. First try. Mrs. Bombs remote. Sure, take it. Drops bombs on every empty space. Tactical board wipe, but don't be stupid about it. Huh. All right. Good to know. All right. Uh, oh, this is the mage deck, which we kind of totally skipped in some ways. I guess we, we better learn how it works. All right. So these buff each other. Uh, so that's worth... One, two, three, right? So, one, two... No. Three. Four. So close. Because we're doing two here. We're killing that guy. How much are we doing? We're doing four. This is worth uh, two because there's another one of its type on the board. Mm hmm. So these these things are locked in. Uh, there's. Oh, that's not locked in. Okay. So we need to get enough of these on the board to. Do these. Uh, help each other out, so that would be like... 
Oh, it's only two. I guess I'm confused what that does. There we go. Okay. The lonely whizbot. Ah, is it? Is this stimulation? Something other than darkness? Many thanks. Do with me what you will. Anything but that infinite darkness. Yikes, that was painful. But we resolved it okay. Uh, in the end. Just double checking that there's not, like, two objects hidden in there. I'm still, I'm still trying to figure out exactly how this works. I feel like I got that one through luck more than anything, but I'm sure either you guys will explain it or I can, uh, I can look it up as well. All right. Oh, I left those things turned off. That's fine. Just solve some easy puzzles. Rotate the sigil until it is upright. Hello? Oh, I actually turned away from it. Yeah, there we are. Um... Is it like that, I think? Okay. That was easy. Oh, I, I, I recognize this area. We need to do that. Select all the squares that contain cards. <laughs> this is like a uh, one of those bot captcha things for websites that you have to do uh, to verify that you're actually a human. All squares that contain cards. Those ones. All right, good for us. We are in fact human, I think. I guess there's no way to be totally sure, huh? Ah, Fishbot. There's some familiar faces that we're seeing. Found me. Good. Robot fish hide me. Revenge for last time. Bad fish. You know, the angler has kind of grown on me a little bit. You know, I, I don't think he's all bad. That's, what is that? Oh, that's the spare battery that we were supposed to, to grab. That's it. Bring it over, he says. That's just the, uh... Who's observing us, right? Now we... Hmm. What might we need that to be powered for? Is there anything else over here that we could find? We already solved that puzzle. We already solved that puzzle. No, I think we're good for the time being. So we'll take that and head back. Oh, which, uh... Which direction are we meant to go? Now I'm forgetting. There we are. Uh, I don't suppose there's anything else that we can interact with is there. Not there. No, I guess that's it. There you go. Yep, thanks. That should do it. Back to the game. Alright, so let's see where we are. So, we're in Eastern Botopia. Can we teleport? Is that a thing? Or, like, fast travel, I guess? Uh, I guess. Let's go up here. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Let's actually keep traveling along the bridge. Revolting. Yeah, sorry that you have to see this. It's the last area in Botopia that still has life in it. 
that stinking, squirming mess of imperfection. I mean, it's okay with me. Uh, that's probably Leshy's cabin up there, I would think. But we can't, we can't get in there. Alright, there's something going on over here. I don't know what that symbol means. Oh no, you came at, uh, just the wrong time. The generator is about to explode, or something. You have to recharge it before that happens. It's a race against the clock. You'll see. Uh-oh. I have to... I have to recharge it somehow? Annoy FM. <laughs> okay. Well, these don't deal me any damage, do they? I guess I may as well just um, put this here because they will just continually do damage passively. When my face says zero, you lose. All right, I can deal with that. Uh, wizard, when one of your creatures is placed in a space, a card bearing this sigil will move towards them as fa uh, far as possible. Okay. So I want to start doing as much damage as I can to the back row. Maybe we'll draw that for next time, I guess. We'll put that there, and they'll start hitting the back row. Hopefully that, that's the type of thing that he needs us to do. Alright, so basically... We just get a free uh, opportunity to do as much damage as we can. A random card is created in your hand. That's pretty good. Um, what do we want to draw? Sure. Let's get some, some good damage going. Throw him there. Oh, no. I didn't quite mean to do that, but that's fine. He's going to destroy that this turn. Um... All right, I think we're in a good spot, actually. You're running out of time. Don't need to be so smug about it. Shield bot. Let's see, how much are we gonna do? We're gonna do three damage. Mm, that's not very much, is it? I feel like it might be better just to, to save our spaces for something a little bit more impactful. Okay, got two more turns. Double gunner, that's what we needed. Ooh, but we can't quite get him in. Uh, but you know, if we, we just put the shield bot down now, then next turn we'll be able to put a uh, double gunner down and carry us home. Yeah, no problem. Sure. Double gunner, get us that sweet cash. Hell yeah. Look at us. You recharged it before it exploded. If I could clap for you, I would. Nice. Good job to us. 17. Alright, what do we have here? Pick one of your cards. Oh, this is where it gets a new improved ability, right? That we get to, to choose what it does. The shield bot it doesn't do a whole lot for me at the moment. I would like to maybe buff it a little bit if I can. No. Ooh. Um, maybe. Mm, nah, none of those are amazing. I guess maybe, maybe this one could be all right. It's going to move around. Yeah, that's fine. All right, let's check out this area over here. Bolt Hound Sonya, or Sonwana, for being literal about it, and Shield Bot. Bolt Hound sounds pretty good, but he needs maxed out energy. 
At the beginning of your turn, a card bearing this sigil will transform to or from beast mode. What does beast mode mean? I'm curious. Let's... Let, I guess we'll find out, huh? And, uh, are we... Gonna be fighting... Who are we fighting now? We've got a bunch of ancient furs. We've got... Uh, Quill over there. At the beginning of your turn, a card bearing this sigil will transform to or from beast mode. Sharp quills, once uh, it's struck the striker, is then dealt to Samus. Yeah, that sucks. But I wonder if Sniperbot could get around that. Like, if Sniperbot hits it from downtown, does that mean I don't get... I don't get killed by it? Is that... Is that how that works? Alright, so what is it doing? It transforms to or from beast mode. That's kind of cool. That's actually perfect to clear out, clear us some space here. Um, why don't we grab another one of these? We'll put him here. Then when he dies from the bolt hound, he'll kill the bolt hound and clear up our back row. That's uh, pretty ideal, actually. Yep, give me that real estate. Thank you. Awesome. Who else is coming now? Another one of those... Oh, it's one of the ones I have, the Sonya. Alright, I'm tempted to throw down a sniper bot. Um, just to see if that works. Hmm. Lonely Wizbot will do two damage and then move. I guess I can just go ahead and kill this thing straight up. I think that's worth it. And that's fine. So we're both going to die, but whatever. Ooh. Interesting. So it's like a little Transformers type, uh, type thing. Type situation. Alright, I think a uh, sniper bot would be very nice. I'm going to be safe there. Um, yeah, let's just keep it there. Down they go. Uh-oh. Oh, honey, don't cry. I'm Rust Rustson. I'll make it swift. Bounty hunter. Let's keep doing that. Ooh, gift bot, that's... Uh, excellent. Let's try to put them there. And I've got three. Double gunner would be perfect to be right here behind the tree, where they can kind of hide and just dish out damage. I need something to block rust, Rusty Rusts and... And so that person is going to be shield bot, I guess. Thank you for your service. And we will probably want to use um, this energy thing next time. What does this do again? Places explode bots on all empty spaces. Pretty annoying, honestly. <laughs> They're going to get a hit on us here from shield bot. At the beginning of your turn, it will transform to or from beast mode, so there's not much point in putting it here, I don't think. Ooh, who do I want to take out? I guess we'll we'll see if this applies. Like, if I hit Quillbot uh, with Sniperbot, will it will the quills affect me all the way over here? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, it does. Unfortunately, that sucks. 
Ooh. Now, why did he move all the way over there? Strange. All right, so well, one thing we're going to do for sure is put them here. What does this do? When it moves into the space opposing a card, they're dealt one damage, so it means, like, if I place it, it's dealt one damage, or, or what? So let's think about this. Uh, I can, I can destroy it with double gunner. I can destroy this guy with double gunner. I actually think I can save my energy, even though I'm very close to death. Unless there's some sort of unforeseen reaction. Uh-oh. I clearly did not read the his card well enough. Oh, I lose all my money? Yes, I want it back. Then get back to the spot without dying again. Oh, interesting. Back to the waypoint. Just skip back to where you were. Not so easy. All the rogue bots just respawned. That's okay. I do I do remember where we were. I do remember where we were, I think. Oh, no, keep playing. It was, um... This direction. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. That's fine. And, uh... Just in time for another confrontation. This guy is so annoying, this quail guy. I do not care for him. <laughs> this bolt hound is going to be a big problem as well. Um, yeah, I think I just need to take one of these. Throw them there. And, uh... Save everything for next round. Man, this is... this is tough. Sniper bot, I guess that's good. Oh, that's actually not amazing, because this quill guy is going to be so super annoying. Where can I put her? I mean, I'm just, I'm just going to... It's going to be kind of a waste, because she's going to die no matter what. That sucks. That's all I can really do. I feel like there's not very much that I can do, unfortunately. I'm not going to give up, but... I'm just like... Leshy fish is near. Must find. Other scribe. Fish too. Deep beneath. I guess the advantage of using the bombs is that all my spaces here will be filled with bombs, which can kill all these guys. Well, you know what? Let's do it. There we go. Suck on this. Okay. I like it. That buys us some time. There's another annoying quill bot over there. I don't have enough for swap bot quite yet. Um, sure, we'll throw him there. Fish. All right, We're, we've been saved from the brink of destruction. Yeah, when are we going to get some actual explode bots to put in our deck? That would be very nice.
Who do we want to stick? Double gunner, I think, right? Yep. Alright, that'll do it. Maybe we'll throw down a sniper bot here. And we'll throw down an... Uh, a me bot. No, that may not be the best move. We'll just keep it with these guys. All right. All right, yeah, those detonators definitely came in handy, I will say. Oh, we're so rich. I want to I want to spend my money, but I need to I need to talk to the 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 trader, the trapper. One of your cards is about to gain an alter ego as a beast. And you get to choose which card and which beast. Oh, that's nice. All right, which card do I want to choose? Oh, they these guys are really excited, huh? Well, you're cheaper to, um, to, to play, so I'll choose you. What do we have? Which beast will live within your bot? Oh, cool. We could do the, uh, the wolf. We could do the bird. We could do the snake. Ooh. Let's do, uh, let's do the snake, I think. That sounds kind of fun. Not what I would have picked. Alright, let's talk to the old prospector, huh? This here gold? I were just about to mine it. Guess all I needed were a kick in the pants. Okay, are you letting me in? Ooh, what is this? area. Oh, we've already been here before. Oh, it's just a fast travel to get through here. I see. Or like a, uh, yeah, like a quicker way to get through. Okay, I feel like we're going to be facing Leshy pretty soon. So with that, we'll take a quick break and uh, prepare ourselves for perhaps our first boss battle of, I don't know, is this considered Act 3? Th whatever this next stage is, we'll be ready for it. And uh, with that, I will leave you to ponder the wonders and terrors of Botopia. Bye for now.